Hey drivers, this is Andrew at Third Coast RC in Houston. Um, we're doing a video today from inside our shop because it's uh, pouring down with rain outside today. Um, so we're not going to be doing any outside running, but we've got something really, really great to show you here that's just come in, um, which is an all metal excavator and the dump truck that comes with it as well. So this is, you know, you're doing it with us here. We're, we're um, Unboxing this, we haven't unboxed it yet, so comes in this, comes gonna come ship to you in this box like this. Um, it's got uh, a couple of pieces of packaging in the top here, we'll just toss them down there. I'm gonna pop it, blow it down. Look at this, it comes in this cool case. This is a really nice case. So let's take a look, let me just shake the dirt off this, uh, off this mat here. Go on, get out of here. I'm gonna get dirt on our nice new excavator Put my mat back in place all right so we got here this real nice case um Wiener is the manufacturer of this uh, of this um excavator full metal it comes in this nice this is awesome case here so let's open this up and see what we got inside okay we got the uh oh, look at that it's lined with felt here we've got the instruction manual here that uh, shows how the remote works, shows how to connect the battery, battery charging instructions, uh, pairing of the radio if you need to do that, um, password settings. So you can set a password for the radio remote control on this one. Uh, how long you've been driving it, it's got a timer on there. It's kind of cool. Um, how to control the digging arm, the driving of the model, light and sound, and this comes with a smoke generator too. Um, it also comes, I think, with um, a jackhammer instead of the bucket, and also like a timber grab claw instead of the uh, of the bucket. So um, let's uh, let's see what we got. Let's open it up some more. So in here, oh wow. Look at that. Um, move this carefully out the way. We have got um, uh, the excavator here, the remote. Let's pull that out. Okay, this is like a real cool remote. It's like a video game style remote. But uh, look, it's got um, it's got a little digital screen on it here. Um, no batteries in it at this time, but we'll deal with that in a minute. Uh, what else do we have here? Okay, we've got some mineral oil here and a few tools. Oh, these might be the attachments to help switch these over. These bolts here. Um, a wrench. Some mineral oil for the smoke system. We got the battery pack, which is a 2000 milliamp 7.4 volt. Um, looks like a lithium ion battery. We have in here the charger, it works off a USB, plugs into your phone block, uh, phone charging block, charges at um, 2 amps, yeah, so that'll charge pretty quick. Um, we got, oh wow, look at that, we got the, the jackhammer with a... Uh, I have no idea what that's for. You must plug it in. Maybe it makes a sound or something. We got a screwdriver and we got the um, timber grab right there. So let's get this guy out of here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to move all this stuff that we just looked at and put it down here inside the box and then. I'm going to pull this guy out of here. In fact, I'm going to get him tightly packed in here. Let's see. I'll grab him here. I don't want to pull too much on. Okay, all right. There's nothing else underneath there. So, i do. Put this down. Push this out of the way. Put this down here. Pull this, uh, just catch it on the floor and the box. Uh, I'm 
pretty sure you can just lift the excavator straight out of there. But well, I've uh, decided to do it the hard way. Um, so there we go. We'll put the box, I'm going to put the box out of the way over here for a moment. Okay, so here is the excavator. And here, we'll get rid of the controller again. Here's the controller. So we've got the excavator here. Um, let's have a look in the instructions and see where we put the battery. Um, okay. So the battery compartment is towards the rear of the excavator somewhere over here and there's an on off switch i feel an on off switch here underneath here so the battery is going to go in here okay look it's a little thing here saying turn so we turn that now look at that this is all metal all metal here this here's where the smoke's going to come out through this little exhaust look here's a connector it's like a mini xt60 call it xt30 uh, connector there so, you know what, I mean, we'll just take a quick look at it and then we'll give it a shot, yeah? I mean, so we got, what's plastic on here? This is all metal, this is all metal. Okay, the window glass is plastic. Full metal tracks, this is metal. These lines here, these hydraulic lines are... Um, Plastic, this is all metal, this is all metal, these lines are plastic, these are plastic. This, the pistons for the arm movement are all metal, except for, no, these feel like metal too, yeah? These might be plastic here, I'm not totally sure, it's hard to tell, but they're very nicely finished. I mean, this thing is, is real nice, yeah? Let's, um, it's quite heavy, I'm going to get my scales. Just go around it, cameraman, and do a few different shots from different angles. I'm going to get my scale. Alright, so I've got my scale here. I'm going to go back around there. Just move the excavator over here. Put the scale on here. And turn it on. And we'll there we go, it's zeroed. We'll put the excavator on here. Don't forget the little part here. So the excavator weighs 12 pounds and 10 ounces. So it's pretty heavy with all this metal parts on it. Um so let's um I'll put this back over here what i'm going to do is i'm going to take the battery and i'm going to charge it i'm going to charge it up and i'm going to set it charging it charges through the balance port here yeah? But if you've got, um, I don't have any of these XT30s in this shop, I'm going to have to get some. So I'm going to go and charge the battery up, yeah? Whilst we're waiting for the battery to charge up a bit, we're going to take a look at the partner to this excavator, which is this dump truck. So cameraman's just going to show you a few more shots of this whilst I put this on charge. Okay, the battery's on charge there. So what we're gonna do, and we'll pop this little cover back, where are you? Well, I'm gonna put this back on, put this little cover back on here. Turn the little latch to close it. We'll move the excavator out of the way. Pop it down here. We'll be seeing you in a minute. Um, we'll put the batteries in here in a minute also. Let's take a look at the dump truck. So this is, the dump truck, um, full function dump truck. So it's kind of a partner to the uh, to the excavator. So again, 
We have not opened this. Cut the tape here. There we go. Let's get this. These are both 114th scale. Recommended age is 8 plus. So we've got instruction manual again for the truck. It's got a nice radio instructions in here. Um, how to put the battery in this guy and how to drive it. And uh, of course the uh, hopper as they call in here, the bed, the dump um, part of the truck goes up and down. Alright, so pull this guy out. The dump truck is not all metal and it's not quite as expensive. So I believe it does have a metal bed but we'll find out this in just a second. So we've got the So here we have, wow well, look at that, that's awesome, we've got the remote, um, remote here, and all different functions on here, we'll figure all this out in a minute, we've got the battery, okay so this comes with a, Nike, uh, a nickel metal hydride battery, um, only 400 milliamps but I don't suppose this uses a massive amount of power, but it is a 7.2 volts. You could surely replace that with a LiPo battery if you wanted. Um, we've got a charger in here. Different connector, looks like a little JST connector. That one we do have in the shop here, so no problem with uh, putting this on the fast charger if we need to. Here's the dump truck out of its packaging. So we do have some metal parts on here, these are, these are metal, the rear tailgate, which I assume opens as it goes up, is, that's actually plastic, but these feel like metal here, the actual, the bed itself is actually uh, plastic, but these are not expensive, the dump trucks are nowhere near as expensive as the excavator, um, underneath we've got uh, Simulated fuel tanks or something here and the running gear um, that looks like See where we can figure out where the battery goes on this Guy if in doubt look in the instructions, but I guess it's gonna go in here. Yeah So let me just uh, we, What we're gonna do now then is we're gonna get both these set up. We're gonna put batteries in the remotes and we're gonna put um, we get our batteries charged up, and we're going to come come right back, and uh, we'll do uh, we'll do um, a running review and see how see how these go. Just pause that. Hey guys, Android Third Coast RC, we're back with the excavator. I'm excited about this. So we got the remote here, put batteries in it. Let's turn it on. So we can see the little display comes on. It shows the time of how it's running. It also tells you the transmitter to battery here. So let's go ahead and turn on the uh, excavator with a little switch underneath here. We'll just turn the excavator on. The lights and the sound have come on. And when it connected, it's actually telemetry in me the, um, the voltage of the, uh, of the battery in the uh, excavator as well, which is, uh, which is really cool. So let's see what this thing can do. Um, We'll start with the big arm up and down. If we look at the big arm up and down, big arm up and down, that's up. So the arm can go all the way up, it's reached its maximum there. And then the middle arm, and it just reached its maximum. And of course, you can bring the, um, the big arm down, the big arm up. And then to do the bucket, it's left and right. Well, that's turning the, that's turning. Uh, the bucket is here, so you can go. And then, of course, if you have something to dig, you could dig it. This is a metal, metal bucket, so it would. There's a little bit of movement in it, but once it gets to that point, it doesn't move anymore. So it would grab and dig. Yeah. And of course, we got the uh, full rotation. And it, 
You see how far it will go? Well, it's got full 360 degree rotation there, yeah? It'll go all the way around in one direction. Um, which is really cool. A lot of the tanks and things can't do that, yeah? But this one can. Um, because then it will move. And it moves using these buttons here, yeah? So if you press one, then it'll move one track, press the other, it'll move the other track, press them both. Press them both together, it'll go forwards, press the top two together, it'll go backwards. And of course if you press them opposite, then you can rotate. Just like the, uh, the real excavator does. And then you can turn the bucket. I mean, that is really cool. I mean, it's a full function um, excavator. We're going to be doing these for about, they're expensive. They're $575, but there's nothing else like it on the, uh, on, on the market. You know, just a little bit less than $600. Um, the lights and the sound, you can turn them off if they're annoying you. Or you can turn them back on. The smoke, let's turn the smoke unit on. So there's the smoke generator going now, and we can see the smoke coming out of the uh, exhaust there. <laughs> that's, that's, that's really cool. backyard with all the metal parts to it then this is the uh, this is the way to go I mean this is top shelf um, RC right here I mean it's, it's really cool I'm gonna turn the smoke generator off because it's going in my face <laughs> I'm gonna turn the sound off and I'm gonna turn the excavator off all right so we're just gonna pause I'm gonna come back and we're gonna look at the dump truck Hey, this is Andrew, Third Coast RC in Houston. We're back again. So now we've got, we've moved onto the floor here, yeah? Still raining outside, so um, we've got the dump truck ready now, yeah? Comes with this uh, remote here. So we just put batteries in the back here, take off the screw, put in four batteries, um, turn it on. And then the dump truck, we turn it on underneath. The battery goes in here. And straight away it turns on with the sound. Um, we got um, full function. We got steering left and right, proportional steering, and then we got backwards, forwards, turn, and then we also got the bed goes up. And as it goes up, the back opens. So that's fully extended. Then it comes back down, box in a position, so take your dump truck, grab it underneath your excavator, and uh, dump your material in there. So, I think they, I'm not sure about it, quite the price on these yet, I think they're about $100, just over $100 for the dump truck that goes with the excavator. So, uh, <laughs> this is a really cool set. That you can get for you know it's going to be about six hundred and fifty dollars all in six seventy five something like that but for under seven hundred you're going to be it you're going to be uh, all set up with your construction site it has the lights when you drive the lights come on the front of the uh, dump truck and then they all it also um, has the reversing alarm when it goes backwards and this doesn't have smoke or anything like that. And some of the parts are plastic, but it's a lot lower price point. So, um, 
check us out on Facebook, check us out on um, Instagram, got any questions, um, post them below. Thank you, bye. Hey guys, it's Andrew Third Coast again, we're back again with the excavator. We've put on the um, the jackhammer attachment now, you just undo these two bolts and these two bolts, it goes right on there, it's really, really easy. So this moves in the same way as the bucket does, yeah? But it actually... has the jackhammer function, which is, uh, which is really cool. Um, I'm going to put the claw on now and show you that, and we'll be right back. Hey, this is Andrew, Third Coast again. So we put the, uh, the log grab tool on here now. So we can see that that opens nicely. You can position it to uh, whatever you want to grab, and then it will actually clamp shut whatever it is you're trying to grab and it'll actually clamp shut pretty uh, pretty aggressively you can see it's got hold of that uh, driver there so if you try to pick up a log or something and clamp onto it that's as bad as big as the claw is that I mean this thing is really cool um, so um, Sorry for the unusual cuts in the video. Um, we'll um, we'll be um, we'll be posting more construction vehicles over the next few weeks as uh, as as they come in. After the holidays, it's been hard to get stuff uh, in front of the holidays. We've got more and more stuff coming in. Check us out online at uh, thirdcoastrc.com. Um, go to our eBay store if you want to uh, purchase any of these items. Um, put comments in the comments below. And check us out on Facebook, Third Coast RC, and on Instagram, Third Coast RC. And we'll see you soon. Thank you, guys. Bye.